Hi, in the previous video, we developed this script, uh, which actually opened the Chrome browser and then it goes to Gmail and by using this username and password, it tried to log in and we successfully did that. But sometimes by running this script, we will be facing this type of issue, like could not sign in you, okay, sign you in or something like, uh, and there is some message over there. So the script is running sometime, uh, for me it's good, okay, but whenever you are trying, it shows you this type of error. And in this video, I will show you how to fix this issue or fix this problem. It's very easy fix. If you know that, then it's very super easy fix. Okay. So before doing that, I want to say uh, thank you for watching uh, this video. And if you like this video, don't forget to like. Or if you don't like, uh, don't forget to dislike this video and put your comment in the comment section. And finally, I will request you uh, to subscribe to our channel if this video is useful for you. Otherwise, you can ignore. Okay. So let's get started. So let's discuss the error first. So basically here Google is showing that uh, your browser may not be secure and there is a message like it is showing you uh, to use different browser. Okay, and there is a link, learn more. So if we click there, then it will open a new tab and it will show you this type of thing that uh, this, this is caused for two reasons, either the supported browser or JavaScript or Chrome. Okay. Uh, Browser, it is showing that this browser is supported, but we are using Chrome browser to automate that script. Okay, but still we are facing this issue. And so this is not valid for us. And then second one, turn on JavaScript on Chrome. Okay, so here it is showing that you can turn on the JavaScript thing. So for that, basically uh, the thing which it is mentioning, I can show you directly. So we have to go to the Google settings. So there is three dot, just click there and then choose settings once you go there and you will find this type of thing then type javascript here and you will see that on result is showing just go there and you will see javascript if you click there and you will see it is on okay so that means this is also on this is not an issue and here it is mentioning that to set it turn on okay so basically the two things which it mentioned is not applicable for us so what we have to do uh, these two we cannot apply because these two already satisfied we have to fix something Okay, so for that case, the first thing is that you have to log in your Gmail account manually. Okay, so let's do that first. So I'm opening my Gmail thing and then I'm typing my username and password. Then I have to put my password. Okay, once I put that password, then hit next button to log in. So now I can log in my gmail so what i have to do i have to go uh, click here google account and then we have to click manage your google account this one so we just need to click here once you click there then you will find this one uh security okay we have to go in the security just click the security tab then in security panel will be on the right side so after coming this security tab uh, we have to change two things basically okay first thing is that we need to disable the two-step verification process. We must need to disable this thing first. If it is on, just click there and then disable from there. And here, if you see off, that means uh, this two-step verification is disabled completely. Second settings, what we have to do, there is another one, less secure app, this one. Okay, so what we have to do, we have to go and we have to allow less secret app on so you have to enable on by default it should be off okay so what you have to do you have to enable this and then you have to go back and it will save automatically you don't need to save because there is no save button okay so basically these two things you have to do one is you must have to disable this two step verification and secondly you have to enable this less uh, allow less secret app on you have to make it on so once you do that then you can do that so I just save these settings and then, then let's go back and I'm going to, this is already saved and it is a warning, just ignore it because we will automate, we know. Okay, that's why uh, we have to change this thing. So basically these two settings must have to check and after that, just close the browser. So I'm going to close the browser and now test the application. So before that, I'm changing my password. <laughs> And once I change the password, 
then I'm clicking right click and then run as Python file in terminal. So if I open now the browser window will be opened and it will able to log in my account. Okay, now that error gone and we are seeing that this type of access that uh, access to less secure apps I enabled that's why I got this uh, access because we changed it uh, otherwise we cannot automate okay so that error is easily you can fix right in this way you can easily fix uh, that issue if you are unable to run the script and I also told you in the last video when I created a video how to automate the, your browser and uh, gmail thing all together that I will post the link now. I complete the video, I will update that video link, and in this way, uh, finally, you can able to uh, fix the issue which you are facing. So, hopefully, by following this video and the other video, you are able to automate your Gmail uh, logging in any Chrome browser, or you can use any other browser. You just need to change the browser uh, driver and software. Okay, okay, thank you for watching. And as I told you, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and hit either like and if you don't like just put the dislike button and put your comment thank you for watching